This week on Drive Time. Third quarter financials show a stable forecast. The Chicago Auto Show goes extreme. And Infinity Formula One gets back on track. Nissan Motor Company Limited last week announced financial results for the third quarter of fiscal year 2012, ending March 31, 2013, as well as for the first nine months. Consolidated net income after taxes totaled $670 million, a year-on-year -year decline of 34.6%. Third quarter net revenue was $27.23 billion, down 5.3% year-on-year, and the company reported an operating profit of $770 million, down 47.4% compared to the same period in fiscal year 2011. Selling 1.159 million vehicles worldwide in the third quarter, a 3.8% decrease compared to the prior year. Nissan's Joji Tagawa said the quarter fell short of the company's expectations, but that Nissan is maintaining its full year outlook. We do have a good uh, uh, positive result, uh, both operational and financial standpoint. But we have a couple of challenges, like uh, China situation, European uh, situation is slowing down. Uh, we are facing some uh, tough time uh, in selling a new vehicle in the United States. Tagawa-san added that with a raft of models in the pipeline, including the Versa Note displayed last month in Detroit, Nissan remains on track to meet its longer-term goals. It's all about performance at the 2013 Chicago Auto Show, running now through February 18th. Visitors to Chicago's McCormick Place will see the U.S. debut of Nissan's 2013 Juke Nismo and the 2014 370Z Nismo, both part of the worldwide expansion of the Nismo brand. Also making its first U.S. appearance is the limited production 2014 GTR Track Edition. This is the third and most exclusive model in the 2014 GTR lineup, with just 150 units to be offered for sale in the U.S. Sharing in the Chicago spotlight is the production debut of the all-new 2013 Nissan NV200 cargo van. And finally, major news coming from the Chicago show is an extension of the popular Nissan Project 370Z, a car built by fan input using readily available aftermarket parts. We got fantastic response from our fans and they, they really embraced it. We started with the engine, it's really the soul of a sports car. I love the design and the unique color as part of the design theme as well. In phase two, social media followers will select a privately owned Nissan Z to compete against Project 370Z in a showdown at Las Vegas Motor Speedway in mid-March. Three-time World Formula One champion Sebastian Vettel and nine-time Grand Prix winner Mark Webber were at Red Bull Racing's UK base last week to give the world a first glimpse of the new Infinity Red Bull racing car, the RB9. The new look integrates Infinity's purple-hued branding with the team's existing race colors. Infinity will become the exclusive vehicle performance partner of the team, in addition to agreeing to a four-year deal to be title partner, as announced in November 2012. And finally, remember that stronger passwords are now required for every Nissan system user in the Americas region. You have until 5 p.m. Central Time today, Wednesday, February 13th, to reset your LAN ID password. Those who miss this deadline will have to follow a formal re-enabling process, which will include an OSS with manager approval. That'll wrap it up for this week. Please join us again next week for all the latest Nissan news. If you'd like to contact us, drop us a line at nissanamericas.today at nissan-usa.com. Thanks for watching Drive Time.